Okay, slick car, bro. Now here's how we're gonna score it. Get ready. You know Tony McTony? Yeah, that Tony McTony, the tech billionaire. Yeah, well, he's a total douchebag. He's always showing up at my parties and stealing the spotlight and the girls and everything. Total dick, bro. Yusuf has way more money than him, too. Anyway, he's a massive car collector, and he thinks he's so cool because he moves his favorite cars around on a private submarine. I could do that over the top shit, too, you know? I just didn't think of it first. But this car? This is his pride and joy. He won it at the LS car meet. Major underground cred, bro. We steal this, Yusuf's gonna love it, and it's a major fuck you. But like I said, it's on a submarine. We need to learn everything we can about it before we could try getting on there. So let's do some research. Okay, so we're hitting Tony McTony. This shit is gonna be the highlight of my career, man. This dude wants to be me so bad. I buy a new boat, he buys a new boat. I say I want three girlfriends, he gets three girlfriends before I do. It's like, get an original idea, bro. So, we're gonna break into his private submarine, which, by the way, is strict the fuck out. Like Meriwether level. In fact, it's exactly like Meriwether's. So, we're gonna go to their headquarters and dig up some intel on how this submarine works. Then, once we figure out how, we're gonna infiltrate it. In the middle of the ocean, while it's underwater. Sounds good? All right. Okay, so getting a car off a submarine isn't exactly a level one thing. Once you're at the HQ, I'm gonna need some pictures so I can figure out how we're gonna pull this off. First, get me some shots of the sub's landing pad, since that's how they get the car on and off this thing, right? The schematics are essential, you know, like the sub blueprints. That way, we got the ins and outs of this thing. Oh, and any sonar jamming equipment that might be an issue, snap that shit too. We need it all. Cool, I just got to pick up the landing pad. This is definitely our best way off the sub, but for obvious reasons, we'll have to make sure it's above the surface first. It'll probably be a good idea to grab some of the guards' outfits too, just in case we need a disguise. Looks like they can seal him up at the first sign of trouble. Do you think a cutting torch would get through those? 